to the Bay Area, San Jose, California, along with Drake Burke, I'm James Sabalski. It's about drive, it's about power. We stay hungry, we devour. Put in the work, put in the hours, and take what's ours. Like in some more in my veins, my culture bringing with strange. I change the game for what my motherfucking name. Did I get the desecration, defamation? If you wanna bring it to the masses, face to face, now we escalating. When I have to butt boost asses, mean on ya, like a dream. When I'm mumbling, you're gonna scream, mama. So bring drama to the king, Brahma. And we are to extreme mana. You can feel the intensity of this one. Total playoff atmosphere, we're underway. San Jose's got control of it now from their own end. Gains the zone from the right. Strong defensive effort. Here he is in front, he scores! What a little pop up for the play! in this crowd. Everybody gets ramped up a little bit. You score early, you hope you can. Now you have, you go get another. Takes a wrist shot, stopped by the goaltender. Lots of time left in this period. The Sharks have taken a 1-0 lead. The Blues take possession off the faceoff. And he slides it quickly to Krug. Feeds the puck across to Shen. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. Quick pass across to Kane. The Blues get a hold of the puck in their own end. And he's taken down the official's arm, signaling for a penalty. From center, they get into the attacking area. And here comes the judgment from the official. So often in a, in a shifty little play that you're trying to get to the puck, you get your stick in the wrong spot, it steps on your stick and there's nothing you can do. St. Louis sends their man advantage unit out for the first time this evening. You never really know when the chance to tie a game will come, but now you've got a great opportunity on the power play. And they move the puck out of harm's way. The Blues have it against the wall. St. Louis gains the zone. The Sharks will play it in their own end. St. Louis gains a hold of the puck against the boards. That's not going to fool them. Move to the middle. He scores! But the special, it's special team. Now the coaches have been talking about a few new wrinkles on the power play. They move the puck nicely, and the puck is in the back of the net on the power play. Now the only way he's stopping this one is if it hits him. As soon as the shooter went to shoot it, the goaltender dropped into the butterfly. He's looking around that traffic, hoping he can find it. Still lots of time left in the period. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. And he slides it quickly to Sanford. Can't keep a hold of the puck after that play. Works it across to Kane. Nice pass. And the puck leaves the zone. Tries to feed it over to Fulk. Let's it go. Stopped by the goaltender. Centering pass. Another stop by the goaltender. Oh, he's on it there. Both saves are really good ones. Oh, and he'll be shaking his head on that as they were so close. The Sharks gain control of the puck against the wall. Moves it quickly over to Sanford. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. Here's a chance right out in front. Makes the save as he got a blocker on it. And he came out and challenged him. Good save. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. Puck grabbed by Dunn. Tosses it on to Thomas. Off target. Taken along the wall by Dunn. Moves it to Fulk. And that goes off a player. San Jose's got the puck along the boards. And a nice poke check inside the neutral zone. St. Louis takes possession of the puck. Pushes it across to Steen. Moves the puck to Bozak. 
Tries to the crease. Oh, what a block. He'll get a pat on the back from the coach when he gets off, if he can get off. San Jose's got a hold of the puck. And now he moves it quickly to Couture. Pokes it away in his own end. From point blank range. He was locked in there. Quick feed to Meyer. Takes a wrist shot. Oh, the puck doesn't get there. It's so crowded in front of the goaltender. St. Louis takes possession along the wall. Quick pass to Tarasenko. Pokes the puck away. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Sorensen. Rocks him on the play. Here he is in close. Denies him with the blocker. What a stop by Bennington. Scores! And he puts his team in front. James' this game looked really comfortable as a tie game. Now they're ahead. They've got to continue to work. James, when they look at the film tomorrow, that's not going to look very good. That's a pretty bad air that led to that goal against. The Sharks get a leg up here by one. Plenty of time left here, but you still have to be happy that you're in the lead. Sneaks away with the puck after he was tangled up on the draw. Makes a move in front. Here's a short pass to Tarasenko. Along the wing up the neutral zone. Puck dumped in and they'll get a fresh group of forwards. St. Louis has it near the wall. Takes the pass. San Jose's got the puck here in the open ice. They fight for it along the boards. Picked up along the wall by Marlowe. Great hit on the play. Gets control of the puck here in his own end. Down the right side and into the zone. And uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. Drills him. And now it's grabbed by Donato. Blasts it. Oh, what a save on the one-timer. Moves it quickly over to Vlasic. Here's a shot. Too much traffic in the lane. Picked up along the boards by Barbashev. They go on the attack through center. Oh, smart heads up play to put that one away. There's the horn ending the first period. It went back and forth, and it's a close one here. Hey, fans, free tickets are still available to our next home game. Please visit the box office and get the well done. And while both teams get a refresher, we'll take one ourselves heading into the second period. zone for the right. He got thunderstruck. St. Louis plays it up ahead. The Sharks have the puck now. Moves it to Kane. Couldn't connect, although not exactly an ideal pass to begin with. Pass across to Shen. Skates across the blue line. Tees him up. Stops him cold. such an integral part of this team's offensive production. He's among the league leaders in this postseason. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. San Jose's got a slim lead. They lead it 2-1. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Sends the pass over. Good defensive effort to poke it away. Sends it over to O'Reilly. St. Louis has it in the offensive end. It's in the back of the net, and we've got ourselves a new game. Always amazes me, James, how one shot changes everything. Now this game is even. If you're the goalie here, you just want to move as quick as you can. Maybe it'll hit you, but it's so close to the net that pass is on the tape and off the tape in a hurry.
Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. St. Louis will go to work as they win the draw. Fultz picking up steam. The Sharks take possession in the defensive end. Working the puck deep inside their own end. Manages to hang on. Oh, he'll feel that one. Perron's got it through center. Dishes it to Dunn. Moves it up through the middle for the right. The Blues carry it along the wall. Picks off the feed. He got all of that hit. St. Louis takes possession at center. Here they are on the attack. Comes up with the stop. I like the way that he stops this puck, James. Not only does he get in front of it, but he puts it out of harm's way. More than half the period left to play. We got a tie game. The Blues win it. Taken by Bortuzzo. And now he angles it across to Scandella. St. Louis on the attack. Oh, and he just puts it wide of the net. Well, that thing's not going to be used again tonight. Strong use of the body to force the puck loose. And it's a quick pass to Donato. Oh, they telegraph the pass, and he picks it off. Nice dish from the left wing. Puck scooped up by Steen. Maintains possession. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Denies him! Scores! The go-ahead goal! Now this game has been tight. Now somebody's got a leg up. Once his puck bounces off the goaltender the first time, the shooter's the next guy in position. The D can't turn quick enough, and he puts it away into the net. The Blues have built themselves a one-goal lead here in the second. Let's see if they can build on it now. They'd like to take control of the game if they can. They now have the one-goal margin, but they want to stretch it out. Locks them up on the draw as they take possession. The Blues grab possession for the puck. Smart defensive play there. Quick feed to Hurdle. Excellent stick work on the play. Scooped up along the wall by LeBanc. Nice poke check. Puck picked up by Shimmick. St. Louis has possession of it now. And they fail to go tape to tape. Grabbed along the board by Tarasenko. Here they come. Tries to get it to Bortuzzo. Great positioning by the defender. The Sharks have been in such good position all night long. Stick position is critical as they continue to intercept a lot of passes. Good battle along the boards for the puck. Taken along the wall by Hurdle. And he makes the save. Oh, and another big stop. Really sharp. Never loses sight of the puck to make the second save. Quick feed to Tarasenko. Knocked away. There's the whistle as things will slow down here for a moment. Always a good play if you're not sure what's going on. Freeze the puck. Bennington's a little bit fortunate there. He makes a terrific stop, but he just gets a piece of it to keep it out of the net. Late goings of this period. The Blues have a little breathing room here, but not much as they lead it 3-2. And they take possession. Nice job tangling him up on the draw. Save made by the goalie. Quick reflexes. You make one, you make two stops before the puck is cleared away. Dumps it in. The Blues get a hold of the puck along the boards. Looks to make a play over to Sanford. Quick pass to O'Reilly. Traps that puck tight to his chest. And the referee has blown his whistle, bringing a stop to the play. The Blues have generated plenty of quality scoring chances and a big reason why they lead late in the second period. They take possession as he lobs. He scores! Jumps on the rebound and makes a count. Oh, 
Uh, goalie burps up this rebound here. It comes right back into the shooting area and the rebound is put away. St. Louis has now built themselves up a two goal lead late in the second. They've earned it too. They've worked hard. They've had the puck a lot. They've not made many mistakes. And now they're just a few minutes from running into the intermission with a couple goal margin. What a steal in his own end. Here's a short pass to Marlowe. He scores! This is not the hockey equivalent of a buzzer beater, Ray. Yeah, it looked like there was going to be enough time to pop in the net. And now they feel really good about themselves going into the next period. Not very often in today's game you get enough room to take the slapper anymore. But he hammers this past the goalie. San Jose's got a chance to change the complexion of this game now with that one. Yeah, get one now, they're within one. Don't take a step back. Push forward. Look for the equalizer. And he comes up with it. And there's the horn ending, period number two. Boy, no shortage of offense here. Time of the goal, 19 minutes, 53 seconds. Third period is just around the corner, so don't even think about putting that controller down. Of this tilt. The Sharks continue to be close in this game, which is maybe a little bit of a miracle. They don't have very much in the way of shots on goal. And he gains the zone here. Takes the feed. Denied by the goaltender. Now a quick pass to Burns. And he takes a shot. That goes off a twig. Picked up along the wall by LeBanc. Shot completely misses on the play. You don't even make the goalie work here. You've got to make him have to do something in the net. Oh, just a textbook hit. Here he is from the slot. Blocker saved by Bennington. Dead center, excellent save. They've totally controlled the puck here on this shift. Now they've worn the opposition down. Eventually, you get a scoring chance or they take a penalty. Stays with it. Moves it quickly over to Shen. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. Move to the middle, just can't complete that pass. Oh, he's got the right play in mind, he just doesn't execute the final pass. Solid check to slow him down. Dished on over to Schwartz. Nothing doing on that. Vlasic's moving it ahead. Goes right to the crease. Puck grabbed by Schwartz. Gains the zone from the right side. A little dipsy doodle and he loses possession of the puck. The Sharks move it in. And now he tries to get it across to Carlson. And that's broken up. Moves it to Perron. Sends it over to O'Reilly. Right to the middle. Here he is, wrists it on net. Oh, he got all of that. What a save by Dubnik. Centering pass in front. Denies him again. Taken down, and the officials caught it. Right up the gut into the attacking zone. Picked up along the boards by Carlson. Time for the official to pass down his sentence. Schwartz is going off for tripping. Played with fire, he got burned, Ray. Oh, he's sticking around for the pocket. Sometimes you just get caught. This time the player goes down, and he's got to go to the box. Here's a first look at the power play. They deserve this power play. The last couple of shifts, they've been threatening for the tying goal. Finally, they earn a power play. Gets it out of his own end. San Jose's got the puck along the wall. Sends a pass over. Picks off the pass in the defensive zone. 
And they get the puck out of harm's way. San Jose's got it behind the net. Gaining momentum along the wing. The Sharks played along the boards. The Blues will try to shave a few seconds off this penalty now. And the puck leaves the zone. Break away! And that falls apart. Well, that's disappointing. Nothing out of something that looked dangerous. Kane's been on fire lately. His point streak's starting to stretch out. This is when you feel like you'll score any game. The Blues continue to lead here in this third period. They've been the busier team offensively. O'Reilly's won the faceoff deep inside the offensive zone. And that one's turned away. Dubnik's going to hang on for a whistle here in the third. Well, there's not much time left here as you get into the final 20 minutes. The game's close. A mistake now would be critical. Past the midway mark of the frame, James and Ray with you tonight. Fans have been treated to a fun one tonight. Lots of offense. It's 4-3. He scores! Vladimir Tarasenko! Well, that was quick. The puck hits the ice, and in a second and a half, it's in the net. Face-off win, one-timer. Nobody catches up to the puck. The Blues' perseverance pays off. They're now up by a pair here in the third. Well, well-deserved, too, I would say, James. They've played a better game now with this two-goal cushion. They want to nurse this thing home. And we'll get a face-off as the puck goes out of play. Everybody likes to think of themselves as a little bit of a clutch performer. If you score at this time of the year, you are that. The centermen glide into position. The Sharks get a hold of the puck off the draw. Quick feed to Hurdle. Moves the puck. And will play on as that goes off the outside of the post. San Jose's close, but they can't get close enough. That shot hits the goal post and stays out. The Blues have it now. From the right side, he goes to the middle of the neutral zone. Scooped up along the wall by Crew. San Jose's gained possession along the boards. Slides it diagonally to Hurdle. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. And he regains control of the puck. And he slides it quickly to Meyer. The Sharks looking against the half wall. Here he is in close. Rocks him. St. Louis plays it along the boards. Coughs up the puck after that hit. Good defensive stop with the poke check. LeBanks gaining momentum. Grabbed along the boards by Burns. They've got the defense outnumbered. Stopped by the goaltender. Bennington's had nights where he's bailed the team out while they're doing it for him tonight. He's really struggled in goal today. St. Louis continues to lead here late in this third period. The Sharks win the faceoff. Fantastic save! Bennington's had to be on his game. That's a great chance. There's another stop. No time to take a breath. He made that first stop, and then the puck turns around on him again. Log jam in front. That's broken up. And he slides it quickly to Couture. Cuts to the front. Comes up with a stop. Taken along the wall by Couture. And another stop. Here in the later stages of this period, the Blues holding down a 5-3 lead in what has been a fun one for hockey fans to watch tonight. And now he moves it quickly to Perron. Into the empty net, and that's blocked away. Moves it over to Marlowe. The Sharks take it along the wing. And a great heads-up defensive play here. The Sharks continue to have solid positioning, intercepting pucks, keeping the game close because there is no room. St. Louis looks to break out in their own end. Quick shot with the stop. Again, the denial by the goaltender. Play set to resume with the faceoff ready to go. Final horn sounds. 
Reigns, and we are all done with this one. Well, we've got ourselves a series here right now tied up at two. Uh, sets up a critical, important game five. Now that we're locked up at two, who will get a leg up again? And that's all she wrote on this one for Ray Ferraro. My name is James Sabolski. We'll see you next time here on EA Sports.